almost there. And voila! Greetings, everybody. I am Resplendent Seraph, and today we're going to be playing more of East Book 1 and 2, a game from uh, 1990. Uh, well, I guess 89 when it was released in Japan, but, uh, but released here in, uh, in 1990. And we're going to continue playing the Turbo Graphics version of this. Uh, one of my favorite games from my, uh, from my childhood. Actually, and it's funny, uh, I think I mentioned this before, but in case I didn't mention this, I actually played East Book 3 first and then enjoyed that game. And I'm like, well, what about this one? And uh, ended up picking this one up later. So played and beat East 3 first, then came back. And f I did at least beat this, well, all the way through once. I then saved it near the end of the game. And then I would at least beat it uh, on a couple of, on a couple of, uh, couple of occasions. <laughs> Tongue twister there. If only Seraph could speak, right? Uh, I swear I can English. In any event, um, did play it enough times at the very end where I remember the last boss a little better than most of this stuff, but I had saved it right before the last boss, so we're dealing with 30 years of very rusty memory as Seraph tries to remember exactly how all this shit worked. And that leads us to the events of last stream where I was running in circles and trying to figure out what the hell I'm doing, and hopefully. Now that I'm a little more awake, because I was also really, really, I, I could feel myself just being exhausted at the end of last stream. So I think part of it was my brain was just, it was just done. Um, and my, 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 <laughs> my ability to figure this stuff out was, uh, was vastly reduced. So that was a, that was a good point to take a pause. But this is a good point for some commentary before we really get into the, uh, get into the nuts and bolts of this game. This was also also coming out when most games were like Zelda. You just kind of run through, you kill everything, and then you're kind of done. A lot of games didn't have a very rich story with a lot of NPCs that you actually cared about. Uh, you had Final Fantasy, but that was kind of it, and it really wasn't this Zelda-esque type of adventure story. So that's one of the things that I thought made... East very very unique especially this first entry where it's not just you run to the various zones and you unlock things and you just kill all the monsters these npcs you interact with them and you kind of care about them like uh we want to we want to try to save maria uh we want to try to figure out where seda is so that um you know we could stop him from getting himself killed uh while he's trying to save his friend maria i don't remember if it's his friend or if it's girlfriend i, I actually don't remember um, but, and it, and the game up to this point hasn't been clear on that. So who knows, right? So we managed to get through the ice park, Burnland, and, um, and solving issues for, along the way. We freed a demon named Keith. We freed the, uh, bridge guard named, uh, the bridge guard's son named Tarf. That allowed the bridge guard to lower the gate and that got us. Uh, to the rest of Burnland, we managed to reach Ramia Village. There we met a couple of people. The Magic of Transform lets us go into Solomon Shrine. And it's, it, I mean, I'm not going to give a complete breakdown because that was all covered in the last stream. You're more than welcome to wa well, watch that. But just for the sake of it, suffice it to say, uh, that's pretty much what we're doing here. And we've managed to get to Solomon Shrine. A bunch of villagers that had been caught, and assuming uh, it's, so Ramya Village, one of the issues going on is sometimes the monsters come and they round up villagers uh, and then for sacrifice, and then they leave the rest of the villagers alone. Well, a bunch of those villagers had escaped, but they won't let me in because I bumped, I ran into the wizard Dallies who turned me into this like monster thing. So, well, me, Adol, whatever. So Adol looks like a monster and we found the hideaways, but they won't let Adol in because he looks like a goon. And they're like, all right, well... You know, and then they tell, we're actually going to go back there and refresh our memory a little bit about that. But one other thing of importance before we really get rolling is Seraph had an epiphany. There is a hallway, so to speak. There's like an area in Burnland where you feel like you're being watched and it doesn't feel like an evil presence, but you definitely get a sense that there are demons in there. And I could sworn that we picked up like a flute or something that kind of encouraged them to come out. And then it occurred to me like, yeah. Or, you know, like a bell. 
like a bell that you rang in Jira's basement to make the monsters swarm in, a bell you already fucking have, <laughs> and I couldn't believe I didn't think of it the other night. So depending on where we are, I might just use the magic of transform, or the magic of return, to go back to Burnland, pick up a rotatory nut, and then we'll go back there and see, because they might, I think they've got an item that's important. So now would be probably a good time to do that before we really get into the nuts and bolts of what the hell I'm doing. So without any further ado, that gets us all caught up. So let's go back to in-game. And I did, at least I think I did, manage to alter this. Hey, Rob, how are you, buddy? Good to see you. Good to see you this fine, fine, cool evening. It's actually nice outside. Perfect. Good. That looks pretty good. Good. Seraph did format this correctly. I was trying to fiddle with the geometry last stream very, very early, and it did not go well. I went, you know what? I will do that later. So I did do that today before getting things started. And, it, and that looks, it looks like Seraph centered that correctly. How's your day going, Rob? Really find out. And that intro is still... NEC, my god, haven't seen that logo since childhood, right? Yeah, NEC is... Uh, NEC published this game, and they also did uh, design the Turbo Graphics. Pretty good, and yes, the weather's been nice. The weather is beautiful. I actually thought about opening my windows, but I'm like, it's not quite good enough to have my windows open. But it was very, very close. And good evening, my good friend Ghosty. How are you? So let's, we're, I know we're in three, we've pretty much been using three as our save. All right, okay, so we're, we're at the beginning. Yeah, we're gonna, we're just gonna exit. Because fuck that. Okay, versus here. Let's go here. Magic of return, perfect. Oh, you know what? Because I'm a monster, they mu this might not work. Uh, I need to be... Yeah, you know what? That's not gonna work. Okay. Well, fuck it anyway. <laughs> Let's... Oh, right. Magic of return is what I want. Let's go to the runaway hideout. Let's just... Let's just refresh our memories. Uh, what they told us. <laughs> and hopefully this time Seraph can figure it out without getting horrendously lost. And yeah, for the most part, we're also going to be spending the entire rest of the game in the Solomon Shrine. Look out! A goon got in. How did you find out that we were in here? I don't know why they say a goon and not a demon, but whatever. Push back the door and don't let the demon come in. And they say demon later, so... Uh, wait a second. Uh, I'm, I'm a man. I was changed to a goon by the wizard. Obviously not all talk in there. Yeah, I doubt it, but if this is true, come back after you regain your human self. All right. So to do so, go to the back left room, which is what we were trying to do, of this shrine. You will find a room whose wall pattern... Oh, you know what? There. Okay, you know what? I need to look for a room the wall pattern is different from that of the other rooms. All right. I forgot. The room pattern is different. All right, so we're looking for the sacred cup, and we need to take that to Evan's house. Well, they're going to tell us that in a minute. And yeah, Priest Dabby, rule of the magic of light. I already remembered something about having used the magic of light to make it appear. I have a friend named Evan who lives in Ramia Village. Take the cup to him. He will tell you how to return to human form. All right, so let's try this again. Magic of fire. Let's uh, make sure... We have an idol of equipped. All right. There's gonna be a monster in here somewhere. Whoop. Shit. <laughs> right there, actually. There's where the monster is. Oh, I went the wrong way anyway. Don't. Let's move. Uh. Almost got hit again there. <laughs> that would have sucked. Go this way. Uh, no. We go this way. <laughs> I don't think we go this way. I think this is a dead end. Yep, it is. But once we drain the water, this is an important way to go. Man, I love that hawk, that idle hawk thing. That's a very missable item, if I remember correctly. Let's 
be there. Now. Pretty sure this is the way we're going. Is that a treasure chest I already got? No, that's a treasure chest I will want eventually, though. Yep, there's a treasure chest right there. I need to get... All right, once I drain the water, I got to remember to come back for that one. Yep, that's the... Yep, that's... Okay. So this... Remember when I was talking about uh, draining the water? This is a control room. I remember that much. It looks different from the other doors. It has a sea dragon engraved on it. So even when I get the master key, I'm still not going to be able to get in there. I don't remember what order of the... I don't remember if I get that first. I think I get the master key first. Yeah, I do get the master key first. That's where we encountered Dally's. So we're in... Okay, we're in Midwest. We need... We definitely need to get to West. We need to get to Solomon West. That's where we're trying to get to. Not get killed here. Not do that either. I think that is that feeling. Here is this ship. Okay, good. Sarah's starting to remember. It is a fucking rat maze. So, Rob was totally right about the fucking rat maze. It really, really does feel like that. So, I feel like this is. We've gone in here a bunch of times. Yeah, this is. Another locked door. Oops. You know what? We're not even we're not even doing that this time. Let's do something. We're not gonna go in there. I need to go over here maybe. Didn't I just come down this way? Yeah, I just came down this way. Okay. But if I can get up there maybe. Oh, okay. Right. Right, right, right. Yeah. Right, this feels different. Cool. Oh my god. Is this gonna be this simple? Okay, so much like last stream where I thought it was gonna take me like an hour to find something, we stumble right across it. Alright, so we used to match the magical light. There's our fucking cup. Motherfucker. How much time, guys, did I waste at the end of last stream looking for this fucking thing, and then this stream I go right to it? Well, you know what, though? It, it matters when you do something different. Uh, Rami Village. <laughs> and sometimes it just pays to take a break. These guys are, yeah, get off me, you brute. Oh, you don't say anything. Oh, help the evil. Evil is so human hunting is You're not gonna say anything, are you? Please bring back my friend Maria. Okay, you, I guess you don't say anything. I thought this woman would say something. No? Nope. Okay. I guess not. Uh, this is Hedit's room. Uh, Hedit? No, what was this guy's name? Oh. He doesn't even let me go in. Cool. Cool, cool. We just gave you a sacrificial offering yesterday. Don't you think it's a little too soon to ask for another? Yeah. Probably. That sure is the sacred cup. Now you can regain your real appearance. There is a very old water well in this house. When you dip the cup into the well, water becomes blessed. Yep, this, this holy water can remove the wizard's curse of e evil ill. Now let me dip the sacred cup into the well. The sacred cup is filled with water. Okay, yeah, this, or, never mind. That was the narrative. The sacred cup is filled with water. There we go. Perfect. Yep, drinking water from this to wa washes your evil away. Cool. Okay, we're back to normal. Fucking hell. Can't believe it. Whatever. Burn it. God damn it. <laughs> I suppose I shouldn't be mad at doing well here. Just can't believe all of that struggling. Wasn't even a big deal. Whatever. Find a strange looking nut. Okay. 
Now let's go back to the beginning and see if Seraph is right about the evil bell. I bet I am. I bet I am. Also change it back to magic fire so I don't teleport. So I don't think these guys even give me all that much XP anymore. Go. Whoops. Down we go, down we go. Not a whole lot to narrate here, we're just backtracking and killing some monsters while we do it. Of course, this is all gonna be silly if we go back there, we activate the evil bell and nothing fucking happens. But I'm pretty sure this is fucking important. Yeah. No, this isn't the hallway. Otherwise, they would have said, you feel like you're being watched. Oh. Oh, shit. Did I miss my chance? This is the... This is the room. Uh, this is the room, right? It's the opening... Maybe it's a different room. Yep, pass. Bring this fucking thing anyway. Oh, cool. Okay, they just didn't prompt me each time. I took a transform because I think I'll kill these guys if I just run into them. Yeah, they look like me. Okay, give me something useful. I was right. Shit. I was two for two there. We're the animals who once lived peaceful lives. Then the demons drove us into this dreadful place. Okay. These guys are. Yeah, these are the old ways. I saw a boy being carried off towards the passage of toxic gas. Oh, carp, okay. No, I know, I want to talk to the other ones. One of you guys give me something useful, right? So I wrote a tree leaf. Okay, yep, nope, already got the grotto tree leaf. One of the monsters told me about that. But, nice to know that that guy would have told me about it. Nope, come on, there we go. Well, I already talked to you. We're friends, aren't we? Why are you attacking me? Uh, and then this guy. You can get to the grabs. Uh, Alright, these guys just tell you things in the event that... Yeah, because you were meant to do this earlier. Okay, I guess they don't give you anything. Never mind. Fair enough. Go to the runaway hideout. I guess there wasn't anything they give you. Shit, I could have skipped it entirely. I could have sworn they gave you something. I guess not. Okay. Now then. Thank you. Guys, finally. Ah, the demon Keith told me that road leading to the goddess's cat. Man, this guy Keith. This demon Keith gets around. Uh, alright. So anyway, the demon Keith told me that the road leading to the goddess's castle is blocked by a pair of statues. Okay, when you wear the goddess's pendant and touch the stone statue. You'll be entrance instantly transported by some mystical energy to the center of Solomon Shrine. They love their teleport statues. Very similar to Darm Tower. So I need the goddess's pendant. Oh, Lilia's in the back room. He must be still waiting for you. This is where Lil Lilia ended up. We managed to lose the goons, but our friend Maria failed to escape. I'm sure they'll kill it. Oh, they didn't get Maria. Green demon freed us. Those of us who escaped the goons are hiding here. Ah, uh, so Keith, Keith is the one who set all these people free. Is that really you, Adol? I never thought I'd see you again. Do you recognize me? I am Lilia from Rance Village. Not long ago, I was caught by some demons as they were rounding up people in our village. Soon after this, a demon named Keith came and saved me. He gave me this key. He told me that I would be able to open many locked doors with it. She gives me the master key. Sweet. 
Okay, that, that figuratively and literally opens many doors for us. <laughs> <laughs> you are a most helpful soul, aren't you, Adol? You have led me to the hideout of these rambunctious runaways. These people have learned all too much about this forsaken land. So, of course, I cannot permit them to live. However, I do have a rather big heart, and I am going to let you watch as I turn their bodies and souls to ice, cold, stone. <laughs> <laughs> now this I do remember. Yep. Can't get anything out of these guys now. But now a lot of these doors will open. Not in the water canal because we still, I think our options are still very limited in the water canal, but... Definitely don't want to activate the evil bell in here. I'll fucking inundate it. But the monster is going to come through there. Prepared to blast it. Uh, all right. So now what am I doing? Um, well, I got the master key, so I may as well open some doors. Right. Go around this way. We. There was at least one out that way. Damn it. I eventually do want to go this way. Once I lower the water, that's an important way to go. I remember that much. Actually, I think that might be... Give me your delicious XP. <laughs> uh, fuck. Uh, I don't think this leads anywhere. Right? This just goes down this way. Yeah, that just goes down. Let me just check. Make sure really quick, yeah. Didn't think so. But I had to check. Actually, I could have just fireballed that guy from where I was. Yep, and we're out. Yep, there's the control room. So now we go back this way. There's at least one locked door that we ran into last time over here. Two or three. Of course, fuck if I remember where they are. Let's, uh, alright, let's go down first. Actually, no. Let's, let's work our way up, because we could always do the magic of transform to Ramya Village, and then come back here. So we're already on the west area. Go through all this door bullshit. Hey, buddy, come here. Uh -huh. Yep, here's the one. I, this wasn't the one I was thinking of. Wait. We did just open that door, right? We literally just fucking opened that door. Why is this tri Fucking A. Alright, I guess this used to be where the fucking goddess's pendant was that I need. You've done we've done it now. Even Adol couldn't imagine where we hit the pendant. It's in the underground water canal to the far east of the shrine. Alright, well. Nice, just 10 away from... Oh, nice! People must be... Are people following now? I'm not getting any notifications. They must be following off stream. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... I'm gonna thank you for that, Ghosty. <laughs> There's probably people in Saram's Discord. Actually, Saram may have something to do with that, too. You know what? While we're at it, let's... Let's do some shout-outs. Because I... I do appreciate the support. My very good friends.
I did like eight Discord advertising. Nice. <laughs> Getting there. Namco Capcom is so fucking awesome. I have so much fun watching those streams. That game is bonkers. I wonder if she ever sees these. <laughs> she's got to like every so often I got to imagine she logs on to Twitch and she's like, why am I getting shout out to this channel? I'm not even there. <laughs> but I am very, very appreciative. So shout outs are super called for. But yeah, we're getting there. We're, we're getting there. Things are coming together, much like this game. All right, so the silver pendant's in the water canal east. So there's no way he could go into the main building of the shrine. All right, so that wasn't all that useful, but... But that was a huge clue that we're going to need. Really? That <laughs> fireball just decided, nope. <laughs> nope, I'm not going to be useful. Now, over in west is... Yeah, there are these doors that go in the fucking circle. But now we've got the key to open some of these fucking doors. So now it actually makes sense to go in the circle again. Let's go up here. I don't think there's anything up here. Oh, yep. Perfect. Master key. Woohoo. Treasure chest. Yeah. Yeah, that's always... Oh, cool. Iron shield. Sweet. Now we got the better shield. Yeah, that's the only only part that sucks about like a really awesome game that you play for a while is when it, when it's over, man. It's it's just over. Oh, okay. Both of these go down. Shit. I don't know what's better to do. Although I think these go in a circle. I think that was part of what was the problem last stream. So I kept going in a circle. So in a way, it was actually unhelpful. That probably is gonna end up being it's an empty room. Yeah, it's an empty room. So we'll go through here. Go to tree leaf. Okay, so we'll do that. Yep. This is just gonna give me one. Stupid, we don't have any healing magic. But this okay. Uh, I feel like there's another locked door. Uh, like there was a long corridor going up somewhere, and there was a door at the end of it. Can I go this way? No, that guy won't get at it. So we just went through there, it led there. Okay. that way. Unless I'm, oh, shit. Right. Okay. We need to go a different way now. We need to go back up this way and around. Get back up this way. We're, we're getting there. Plus, we're getting XP on the way. Ah. Oh, wait, thank you. I'm okay today, sort of. Late response. Had to get food for, ah, uh, gotcha. Yeah, food's important. I also eat at really weird hours. So I definitely know what that's like. Okay, so let's cruise over here because it was a different stairwell, right? And it went up this way. Let's go up this stairwell. and see if there's anything different up this way. It's amazing. I'm starting to actually remember this shit. But I think there's another door over here. I think. Maybe. Or is this just a dead end? <laughs> that might be it over here. Maybe that was it. I could swear there was another door, though. You know what? I bet you it was this one with me thinking, yep, we just saw this earlier this stream. Here's the door. This is what I was just thinking of. Cool. All right. What's in here? Never mind. It wasn't even all that useful of a thing. I don't ever remember even using Magic of Time Stop. But it is somewhat useful in that it will freeze enemies. Not like totally useless, but I don't remember this being all that great. 
bastard. Well, at least he gave me XP. Okay, so now... Now we go back east. You know what? Let's just... Let's see how much of this Seraph is actually starting to remember. Now. Instead of using the magic of return to Ramia Village, although I may want to do that anyway just because I'm starting to lose a lot of health. I'm getting pretty fucked up. Right, this is the water canal entrance. Uh, right, we need to be up there to go. Right. Yep, cool, okay. Right? Or is that the upper area I want to actually be on? I think I want to be down, though. Nope, it's... I think it's over this way. Right, that was the gate. We had to get through the gate. We needed the password to get through that. Now we're back in the middle. Okay, it's cut. You know, repetition. We get it. We eventually get it. Although by the time Sarah figures out how to navigate all this shit, <laughs> which all looks the same, oh, by the way. <laughs> Alright, this is the... Oh. That's a boss room. Uh. Uh. Alright, let's... Let's... Let's save, but we'll put a pin in that. <laughs> Let's open some of those other... I know there's a... There was at least one other door over on the right that we couldn't get into. Uh... Fuck. Alright. Magic of trans... Magic of... Ramy Village. We're now down to like half health. I'd rather... I'd rather just heal up. I don't want to get too fucked up here. Yeah, we're gonna be coming to Ramia Village a lot. <laughs> yeah, now there's yeah, they don't she doesn't say anything to the monster. Interesting. You still say the same thing? Yep, alright. But it's nice to know that people dream and tell me they're gonna help me. Yeah, may as well just do this. Ramia Village. Back in we go. There is no way you can get the magic of time stop before the magic of transform. I wonder why the magic of transform is so far ahead, unless the, unless the game developer just decided to fuck with you and make you think you missed something. That just seems, that just seems mean. <laughs> right? Uh, yep, good. We're gonna go this way. It's been a while since we went east and there's nothing here. Oh, we check anyway, just to verify memories, right? Yep, good. Well, that guy took some damage. Let's kill him. Good. So up this way is the way we went for the pass. Uh, I don't remember there being anything. No, that's just connects to that. Right, that's another alternate way up. Good, we don't need that. Over here we go. Cool. To Solomon Mideast we go. Although I don't remember that many locked doors over here. But there's at least, at least one. I think there are two. Yeah, okay. Well, ah, it hit that one. <laughs> Wait, there's nothing else to do here? There's the gate. No, that's just there. Wait, is there nothing else to do here? Ah, there's nothing else to do here. It just looks more complicated than it is. It's just a straight hallway. Crafty, crafty, crafty. All right, cool. Good. We don't actually have to go down that way and get all fucking confused. That's where the gate was. But still, let's cruise over here just to see. So that's... Once we eliminate, yep, nothing here. Once we rule out this, then we can cruise up and go truly to Solomon East, where we eavesdropped on that meeting. Make sure there's nothing we had in there. How do I get down? I think that's how I get down here. 
Not how I get down there, right. God damn it. Yes, we do have to go around this way. Dang. Oh, damn, really? And then this leads... But then this leads over. Yeah, this will lead... This will lead out. Maybe not, jeez. Could have sworn. Alright, we'll come back for those... For that... Maybe there's nothing else... Oh, okay, there's nothing else here. It's just... Just here for Seraph to get lost. Kill you just for the sake of it. Oh, maybe this works. Oh, okay, well, here's one of them. Wait. Is this just another way down into the water canal? Okay. I feel like I'm still missing something, but that's okay. You know what? Let's... Let's go save here. Okay, status canal east. All right, so now here's how we got this canal east. This is where the goddess's pendant... <coughs> Pardon me, sorry. The goddess's pendant is over here somewhere. Since we're east. Oh, that's interesting. Is that how that all connects? Maybe that's all just that treasure chest? Yeah, that's a treasure chest. Let's see if we can get to it. Yep, we can get to it. Well, let's go see what that treasure chest is. Is that our pendant? Yahoo! That's our pendant! Perfect. That is awesome. Okay. I still feel like I'm missing a treasure chest up, up above somewhere, but you know what? We'll... We'll dig around through that later. We did the plot important thing. So that was kind of cool. So now... Uh, yeah, I think I'm remembering now the order of things. Okay. Ooh, oh, okay. I can't get to that until I lower the water. Thank you. I don't feel like getting cheese balled there. I think that might be all we're going to be able to do in this area. Shit. Okay, that's just a circle. Fucker. So you. So we did all that, right? That's how we got the silver pendant. This is the way we came down. Right? All right. All right, we have options. This is the way up. Ah. Damn it! Oh, did I not buy a new herb? Fuck, that's why I wanted to go to Lance Village that one time. Uh, am I going to remember how to get down here? Uh, peace of mind ring. Well, we went over to Solomon East and we work our way down. Yeah. Yeah, all right, fuck. I fucked up. Well, unless I save. You know what? I'll just save. I'll save and I'll be very, very careful. We went down to the right. Let's go down to the center. And I'll try not to die. Oh, well, there's nothing to do here anyway. Hey, asshole. Come closer. Wow, they almost have full health at this point down here. All right, so there's really... Shit out of me for a little while. That hurt a lot. Oh shit. We're good, we got him. Here. Let's look at XP while we're doing this shit. Anything important to do here? Should be at that end. Round. 
that guy in particular. Okay, and it's just a circle around there, but we came from that direction. Okay. Circle, okay. Let's see how much of this Sarah fucking remembers. Didn't we go this way already? I don't think so. No, we just did a circle. Yep. We just did... I think we did... Yeah, we did just do a circle there. It just indeed do a circle. Let's go back down this way. Let's go to the other path. Ah! Make me waste magic. So that's where that way goes. Oh, that's it. Shit. There isn't anything else down here. Go down this way. Oh! <laughs> Oh, right! The stone statue with a sword in hand stays quietly on guard, and he's also turned to stone. I remember this guy. This is Sa this is Sada, the dude's son. Why the fuck is this guy looking for Maria down here? I forgot. I totally forgot he was down here. You know what? I think that might be all that's important down here, though. There's the, yeah, there's that locked door we saw earlier, but we couldn't get to it. Everything's locked. Okay, I think that's all there is to do down here. I really feel like I'm still missing a treasure chest up above. But maybe Seraph's misremembering. Alright, uh, that being the case, yeah, let's magic of return. I'm in the village. I don't think I can do anything now uh, until but well, let's see around me a village let's try and talk to this dude see if he does have anything else for me my son's life depends on you please search well I found him technically although Adol doesn't know that because he's still a statue but I figured I'd talk to him anyway love exploring the hills you know what let me just talk to old man Evan now that I'm a human I forgot to do that Hey, that's the legendary pendant of the goddesses. How did you get it? All right, well, at least we're getting new text. In the only days, only the chosen few could go into the courtyard of the shrine. Legend has it that the pendant was the pass for the priests and goddesses to enter the yard. But now that the shrine is under the control of the demons, and the pendant is of no... Ah, uh, and now the pendant's no use as a pass. All right, cool. Nothing else. Do you say anything different? Nope. All right. Whatever. Let's heal. <laughs> I still feel like... I, I have a feeling I know where I need to go, but I want to just make sure there are no more locked doors because a lot of times, as you guys have noticed, behind locked doors are treasure chests. And, you know, we already got a really good shield out of it. And I think there's an... I mean, who knows, right? There could be a sword. But, uh, although we've got the same ones, but I feel like now that we've got, I feel like now that we've got it. Oh, right. It's village. Since we're here, we'll talk to Bernice. We'll have her give me a full health update. Rather than go and get the Rota tree. Do 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 do. Marvelous. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm only here for your sweet, sweet HP and MP refill. I will do my best to bring her back home. <laughs> yeah, we thought she just ran, ran off. Uh, actually, I thought she just ran off, but turns out she was captured by goons. Yep, perfect. Uh, no, I'm not gonna buy the life drop. Ramia Village, we'll just start from the very beginning. Hey, Deep Fry, how are you? Hello, hello. How are you doing, my friend? We're continuing on our quest to play uh, East 2 here. We're moving right along. Making some progress. Still getting lost, but, you know, so it goes. 
All of them are like, it's you again. And they always let me in. I'm good. I'm good. So far, the week has started off nicely. See, okay. I want to make sure I didn't get, like, <laughs> massively. You know what? Let's save. Let's save. <laughs> oh, nice. You beat East 1. And you beat the Steam version. Nice. Yeah, you know, one of these days I got to play the Steam version and uh, and really appreciate the better graphical experience. From what I understand it, it's almost a one-for-one -one recreation of this. So we're just going through this massive Solomon Shrine. All right, so there's the gate, right? But there's nothing else to do here. We just go this way. Let's see. Uh, are you able to turn down the music or turn up the mic? Oh, is the game audio a little loud? Oh, let's let's adjust that. Because um, I'm in yellows, so let's turn down the uh, game audio a little bit. Uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. There we go. Turn that down a little bit. Are those are those levels a little better? <laughs> Because yeah, if I turn my mic up any louder, I'm gonna I'm gonna be redlining over here. But that should that should help out with that. And if uh and if I need to tone down the um the game audio, I can certainly do that. Uh further. Let's Solomon East, perfect. Okay. So let's do this. Yeah, I appreciate that. Yeah, and if uh if game audio is ever too loud or anything, exactly what uh uh feel free to just chime in and let me know. Oh, I already killed him. Okay, so I feel like that's the door I probably want to get to. But I, yeah, I can't get to it from over here. And this, yep. Oh. Damn. Still got flipped here. And for all I know, there's nothing to even be gained over here. I could be just wasting my time. Though I don't, I don't think I am. Pretty sure this is all stuff I'm gonna want. If I could just get to it. There we go. Alright. I think. I think this is the only thing that really remains because the other way actually led down to the um to the water canal east. Uh, so why is the vampire in dark fact such uh, such BS. Uh, so here, you're gonna need to be a little more specific. Uh, the vampire bat is a total bastard. <laughs> uh, and yeah, dark bat can be can be very tough. Uh, although we managed to beat him on the first try, but I also had sort of remembered his attack patterns. So so dark fact wasn't wasn't too bad. At least in this version, I don't know if they changed dark fact um, for uh, for the Steam version. So, uh, uh, or are you asking why I had trouble with them, implying that, that you didn't? I hope you didn't have, have trouble with them. Because um, it's not fun dying over and over again to a boss. Because, yeah, that bat, that bat killed me over and over and over again. It was bad. Uh, all right, so we can't get around that way. Is there anything else over here? I feel like there is. But maybe, maybe Seraph is misremembering this. Let's just make sure that there is not anything over here that I missed. We want to make sure we're not missing any locked doors. Whoops. Nope. You're who I needed to talk to before. You gave me the, uh, yeah, lots of, yeah, I bet. And the level cap is 10. So you're right. You can't grind out of it. It's brutal, man. It's, it's brutal. I don't know why they instituted that level cap. Um, obviously they did not do a level cap in this game. You can be max level in the entire game, have 255 hit points, and fight Dark Fact. They let you do that. All right, I guess there really isn't anything else over here. Although I really could have sworn, but since we're over here, let's... Since we're over here, let's just make sure. We went around this way, there wasn't anything there, so we can go up this way, we can get out. There probably is not. I'm... I'm... It probably was just that one door to get into the water canal. 
which was important because we got that extremely important pendant. But I really feel like... really feel like there was something else. Really, really is not... It. Oh, you know what? Yeah, let's... Okay. Let's go back out this way. I like the rock in the head one. Yeah, that one, that one's fun. <laughs> there are a lot of fun bosses in that game. That guy. Okay, let's go down this way. Okay, let's go all the way around. And let's just make sure. I think this is the last door that we could even go through. We were pretty... Oh no, that's... This is the way... Oh no, that's the way up. All right. So up we go. Maybe it was just a... Oh, okay. Yeah, it was a shortcut around that way. Okay. Let's go back to east. Just make sure there's nothing else out there. Don't... At this point now, I'm thinking there isn't. Maybe there isn't. Damn! Really? We're just gonna have to go back to Ramya Village and reheal. Although we could just exit the shrine at this point the normal way. We don't have to use the magic of transform. Uh, is this the way we went to get out? I think this is the way we go to get out. Nope, that's just a door. <laughs> no, no, rant, rant justified, bro. Those, uh, even on this version where you can grind, those bosses are, are awful. Uh, I mean, I definitely died to that stupid bat. Like, for a good solid... I, mean, I think you were even here for that. Uh, I died to that stupid bat, like, for a good... I don't know, what a, whatever it was. Like, uh, like, a good half hour. It was... It was bad. Oh, shit. I went the wrong way. All right. Let's go back down this way. Right? Yep. Okay. This way? Oh, shit. Oh, maybe that is it. No, this is the way up. Right, okay, this is the way to east. Well, let's go this way. Just in case there's something this way. No, okay, this is just this way. I don't think there was any... Oh, that's how I get over here. Okay, so let's make sure there's nothing in... Oh, no. Yeah, we were in here already. No, we're good. We're good. We're good. Right, right. Right. Sorry, Seraph is still in the process of re-remembering this game. <laughs> and there's a lot... I mean, there's a lot. I'm actually... Yeah, luckily it's a fast game over. Yeah, yeah. But you just die over and over and over and over again. <laughs> uh, Count Dushkula is what my uh, chat called it. It was uh, it was pretty fucking brutal. Yeah, I died a lot. This is a dead end. Yep. All right. So now this is the way to east. Shouldn't. And this is the way to the water canal. Yeah. All right. Never mind. That's. That's all she wrote. And then this, yep, water, then this leads to the water canal. All right. Well, now I know exactly how to get over here. I know where I'm going. Let's see. Let's just... Good grief. Do I use the magic of transform to go back, or do I just work my way back? Uh, what do you guys think? Should I warp or just... Go back. At this point, I'm pretty sure I remember the way, so I could just work my way back. This is not the way to go. I just want to make sure there's nothing else down here that I missed, and there is not. Okay. Yeah, there is nothing. There is nothing. So yeah, fast travel or <laughs> we're just work our way back. It's not even going to be all that far. Well, that might... I just did do it through a fucking circle. You know what, though? I don't remember... No, we did this. We did this. Right? We did this, right? Pretty sure we did this. 
Well, let's just make sure. Wow, that's a lot of doors. So let's let's just make sure, actually, because I don't remember for sure if I did this. This leads up that way. This leads down this way. Okay, yeah, we did this. <laughs> Answers that question. Did in fact do this. Yeah, that's where we found that uh, goddess's ring, the thing that makes us go faster, whatever the fuck that means. So now we go this way. We've gone too far. At this point, there's no reason to conserve, uh... No reason to conserve, um... Nope. So many interior hallways. Nope, that's not the way I want to go, but let's check it out anyway. There's nothing useful down here. Okay, maybe I don't remember the way out as well as I thought I did. <laughs> now that I'm down, I watch the pods. Yeah. They're also up on my uh, on my YouTube channel as well. Hopefully that makes life a little easier. Yeah, a billion fucking doors here. Uh, how did I get in here? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know what, though? I actually, I feel like I'm starting to remember. Like, I really do feel like I'm starting to get a handle for the shrine. But yeah, if you... In a perfect world, you'd, like, draw a map. For sure. Although, it would be one big map. Um, fuck, you know what? Let me just do this. Let me at least get most of my HP and hit points back with Bernice. Good old magic of, of return. Do, 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 do. And now we're going to go into that boss room. Go the old school route. Yep. Free, free MP boost. Granted, 20 MP of that we're going to use up to get back to Ramia Village, but whatever. I'll still have a lot of that MP for the fight that I'm going to need. I don't remember what the boss is, but... Here we go. You again! <laughs> I love how the guards don't get suspicious for the fact that they never see me leave. They only see me enter. <laughs> like, literally, I never leave. I only enter each time. All right. I am level 53. Am I high enough level for this? We're about to find out. Okay. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. <laughs> All right, I guess I properly leveled. Uh, I also did the boss rush mode. Oh, they have a boss rush mode. That's actually cool. There's no boss uh, rush mode in this game. Um, all the pra it wasn't as bad. All the yeah, all the practicing does help. <laughs> all right, so I was worried about that for nothing. I guess I've been leveling properly, getting lost around Solomon Shrine. <laughs> okay, and now. When Adol stands in front of the statue of the goddess, the scroll of guidance begins to glow. All right? You can be instantly transported by placing the pendant around your neck and touching the statue. 
Right, right. Okay, the left way. Uh, okay. Okay, I'm still in Solomon mid here. Good old teleport statues. But now I am in the inner courtyard. So now a brand new area that I don't have. <laughs> Just when we were starting to get our bearings. Oh, for fuck's sakes. All right, so that's a way up. There's a way out there. All right, what's the best systemic way of figuring this out? Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Let's go the one direction. Solomon Main. Ah, okay. So we're Solomon Main 1. Okay. Well, we're in the main part of Solomon Shrine now. Re-equip. Idol of Hawk. And now our enemies have full health. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, there's nothing to the right. Okay, so now we just work our way to the left. We just came out, right, we just came out that door. So let's see what's out here. Let's just stay on the ground floor. See if there's... Do this systemically here. Let's let's have a system here. Uh, well, it's pretty cool that I can hit these guys and they can't hit me. That's pretty nice. But, all right, so I think okay, and that connects to that. All right, so that's just one big. All right, so those are just two exits that go to the same place. They just work their way around. All right. So let's go up. I don't think there was any other way to go down there. Let's go back out. Let's just take this one floor at a time and remap all this shit. All right, so this is the way up we came. Let's see, is there any? Nope, can't go down there. Perfect. What the hell is that? <laughs> no, it's dead. Whatever it was. And here. Okay, so we come out there. There's nothing else to do. Okay, there's literally nothing to do here. Okay. So far, so good. All right, so we need to go that way. If we ever come back this way. That's good. That means we shouldn't, theoretically, be able to get lost as easily as we did over in some of the other areas. Solomon Main should be a little easier to navigate. So, if we can't understand them, let's be a demon. Hey, buddies. Oh, shit. All right, I was chasing Keith and I was right on his tail, but then he pulled a fast one and I lost him. Sorry, sir. Fuck. So now they're chasing... Now they're chasing Keith, okay. I heard that the key to the water control room is missing. Could it be the traitor Keith who stole? Ah, okay. So if we find Keith, now remember Keith is who we gave the blue orb to in Burnland Prison. Uh, and Keith's also who let all these demons out. So he's been, he's been a busy little demon. Uh, so yeah, <laughs> that traitor, um, thank goodness for that traitor Keith, okay. Weird name for a demon, but hey, whatever. <laughs> so yeah, we find if we find key, Keith, and we'll have the key to the control room. We could lower the water, and then we'll be we'll be in good shape. All right. I'm gonna leave those guys alone. All right, so we need to find we need to find Keith. Wait, I said they lost him. All right, so we must Keith's got to be somewhere in here. So let's go try and stay on the same floor first. Okay, we went the right way. Shit, in a way that's bad. All right, well, I'll save it here and then we'll go explore. 
Uh, I finally trapped the traitor Keith into the area behind me. It's just a matter of time before we catch him. Okay. So... Save. Alright, so Keith is in Solomon Main 2. Got it. Let's... Let's make sure we didn't miss anything. And hope we can find our way back. There's nowhere else to go. Really? There's really nowhere else to go? Oh. Yeah, Main... Man, Solomon Main is a lot easier to navigate. Holy shit. I guess the game kind of... I guess the game developers took pity on us for all the bullshit we may, we had to go through to get here. Or did I not go in these areas? Oh, nope. Master P, I passed this area. Good, I'm glad I came back. Oh, shit. All right. <laughs> let's see what goes. Let's go. Let's see what goes over here. Shit. I almost missed that. Very easy. I could have very easily missed that. Is this the way we came? This might be the way we came. You know what? I think this is the way we came. Yeah, because there's nothing... Okay. Yeah, I think this might be. This is just natural. This isn't the way we came, but there's nothing else to do here. Sure. Okay. Yep, cool. Alright, back up we go. We'll cruise around over there. And then we'll head down that area where, uh. Let's see if we can find Keith. <laughs> Speaking of which, 65,000. Yeah, we're, we're trucking our way to level 55. So, so far, granted I'm going to knock on a little bit of wood here to not jinx it, because I really don't want to invite disaster, but so far, we're a lot less... There's nothing else to do down here. Uh, I feel like we're a lot less lost <laughs> than, uh, than we were earlier. Oh, and we're probably going to be back in the water canal, but now we'll be back in the water canal in the main. Yep. Oh, we're back in canal mid. Right, we'll save. We're probably now in areas that we couldn't get to before. We probably could see them, but we couldn't actually get here. Yeah, we were probably over there. Um, of course, I... Not really sure where I'm supposed to go. Oh, that was just a corner. <laughs> so far, just kind of working our way, working our way over here. I'm trying to do it in a way that I'll remember. Uh, oh, okay. So that was it for this. I don't know if I'm supposed to be going west or east. I guess we'll find out. Uh, that's it for that. Try to go down a little bit. That's it for that. Go over this way. Then we can kill that guy. Probably not. Yep, okay. Not the way we need to go. We probably needed to go all the way east. So we had a 50-50 shot at it. We just chose poorly. <laughs> That's okay. Back over here we go. All right. I just want to make sure it wasn't a fake wall. Sometimes they do that. Making our way over. I think this is the way we came down, right? Can't go up that. Yeah, this is the way we came down. <clears throat> this is the way we came down. No worries. <laughs> More rat maze. But, uh, 
I just saw that. Damn it. Trying to see the treasure chest. Fucking thing. That was a treasure chest over there, though. All right, well, whatever. I did see that treasure chest. I wanted to confirm if I was, like, crazy. I don't think I am. Wait. Yeah, this is... Okay, that's just a circle. Okay. Damn, it took a lot of damage, man. Broad. All right, that's just these... Okay, yep. Good. That's just one... It took a lot of damage. <laughs> Q, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> All right, well, I know Keith is down here somewhere. I just gotta find him. Fuck. I feel like I explored all the left. But I almost feel like I, yeah, well, we're, now we're back here again. Come on, fine. Damn it, now he runs over. Now we're gonna hit a. Yep. Gonna hit that dead end again. Uh, which way did I not go? This works around this way. Oh, right, that's a dead end. Forgot already. So this, when you see that, that's a dead end. Don't go down that way again this time, Seraph. This way. This just leads up, right? Yeah, this just leads back up exactly where we just were. Yep, good. Okay. All right, we were doing so well. Okay. We definitely don't want to go left anymore. Fuck, but there's really no way to go right. Unless I need to go... All right, so what I probably need to do is I need to go over on that ledge. No, that's a dead end. So unless there's a way up and over... Well, maybe there's a way up and over. That leads... Right, that leads down. This goes in a complete circle. Yep. This just goes in a... Both goes in a complete circle. But you know what? Let's... Let's be thorough anyway. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Right, that's just the way around. Okay, yep, that's what I thought. Okay. All runs around. Okay, we need to go this way. And then I think what we need to do is as soon as I can, I need to start making my way over to the right. Okay, yep, that's that's what I think I needed to do. I needed to cross here. Okay. I don't think there's... Damn. Yeah. Fortunately, I did need to save that. Uh, yeah, let's not mess around. Let's just use the herb. Yeah, I definitely don't want to die down here now that I'm getting the lay of it. That's also a lot of XP I don't want to lose either. Okay. I should have saved after... that. Okay. Okay. Back okay, now we're over on the right. Okay. Okay. Question is... Ha! From his Voca shell, Adol hears a voice calling his name. Adol, there's a kid here to see you. His name is Tarf. What's Tarf doing back in Ramia Village? Come back to my house when you were able. I don't remember Tarf coming to Ramia Village at all. Uh, do I need to turn into a monster for this? I don't think I do. I think Keith is cool, but let's save anyway. Cool. I am Keith. I heard your voice when I was locked in the lava prison. I was spotted by a guard and chased, so I decided the safest thing to do was to hang out here until the coast was clear. If you want to get to the inner courtyard of the palace, then you must go through this water canal. I have the key to the water control room. 
close the water gates and dam the canal. Then you can make your way up to the inner courtyard. That took way too long to proc to profit process. Oh my goodness. Okay. So, uh, <laughs> all right. So now we have the key to the water canal. That is fucking huge. Okay. So now we got two things going on. Um, you know what, let's just, since we already had to deal with all this bullshit, now we could drain the water and we don't have to use the. Now we can drain the water canal and actually get access to places we couldn't before. All right, let's... Yeah, let's just do the magic of return. Now I'm pretty sure I've been anywhere, everywhere down here. Let's go see what Tarf wants in Ramia Village. Oh yeah, the Solomon Shrine is way, 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 way more uh, open-ended. Uh, pretty much half of East 2 takes place in the in the Solomon Shrine Mega Dungeon. It's, it's huge. It's fucking huge. At all, it's me, Tarf. A man in a dark robe came to Burn Village after you left. He was asking a lot of questions about you. Well, probably Dally's. I sensed something odd about him, so I followed him around the village. Eventually, he went into the shrine. Well, so, that tells me that. Cool, so Dally's was looking for me. That really all you... That literally all you told me? Yep, that's all he tells you. So while he repeats this... Ooh, ooh. So clearly the main, almost the main antagonist of East 2 is Dally's. He's who you interact with the most. Um, we know Darm is the source of the, of the evil, because uh, the books of East told us that. But, um... But yeah, we, we pretty much... Mostly just interact with Dally's the whole time. Let's see. Uh, yeah, fuck it. Let's go to Rance Village. We'll buy another. We'll buy another herb to heal up if we need it, and uh, <laughs> and we'll have Bernice heal our magic so that at least we're only missing twenty when we go back to Ramia Village again. It sucks to do that, but it's not the end of the world. Yeah, I know, and you always take forever to tell me. All right, but now we can drain the water and that will let us, wait, maybe the, you know what? No, we're, Solomon Main is the main. We're still not in the main courtyard. Uh, draining the water canal gets us into the courtyard. Right, they did say that. Do do Ramia Village. Here we go. Thank goodness for the magic of return. Granted, I'm I'm remembering how to get around pretty well. Like I could just run from um from Rance Village to the ice through the ice park through Burnland and get back to the shrine. It really wouldn't be that big a deal, but but the magic of transform is an absolute godsend, for sure. Okay. So, I am going into the water canal. Right, because now I have the key to the water canal. Keith gave me that. Yep, okay. So we need to go back this way. Please go. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> I was scared there for a second. I'm like, uh, I should be able to go up and to the left. Thank God the music is amazing in this game. Otherwise, it would get so repetitive. Go after that one, not that one, but whatever. Nope, that's not what we want. We want this way? No. I think I think I want to go up. 
We need... Oh, actually, I may have gone too far. Because we're in Solomon West. And the water, the main entrance to the water canal is in Midwest. Unless it's here. I don't think it is. I think I went too far. Yeah, I went too far. I went too far. At least they figured out we went too far. Because we want to go... Granted, I could just... You know, maybe I should have just warped to the frickin' hi uh, hideaways. But this is what I was looking for. But yeah, I could have gone to the hideaways. Uh, the runaways hideout. I could have just warped straight there. We were already... That's already in the water canal. But it felt like this would be easier because we're just going to go straight across. Open the door. Yep, Adol has used the key to the water canal. All right. When Adol pushes the panel, he hears the harsh sound of grating metal and the flowing of raging water. Woohoo! There we go. And now we can, for the most part, access the entire water canal now. So now let's try and find those treasure chests that we couldn't, that we could see, but we couldn't get to. Uh, shit. Shit, shit, shit. I think this is not the way I want to go. Yep. All right. <laughs> I mean, ultimately, that's, that's actually, I think, where we want to go. But I'm looking for, I'm looking for treasure chests, and there were a few. Like, there were, there were a bunch of treasure chests. Yeah, like that one. Like that one. I get to that. How do I get to that? Get to that. Urgh. Now we wander. <laughs> now we wander a fair bit. It's like, try to remember where those steps down were. There are a couple. And we just went full fucking circle with that shit. Damn it. Mm. And the problem is, if I'm remembering this correctly, so here's one issue, right? And I remember this. There are a bunch of these grates. So if you want to get down to this area, you have to make sure you take the stairs down. Damn it. In this area. I think, for the most part, the grates aren't too bad over here. Gets me over here, but I don't think... Nope, okay. Okay, right, right. Okay, that gets us to this one. But I know there's one down south. Ah, battle armor, nice. Okay, I don't think any of these, tre these treasures are probably not all that critical. But, we do like better gear. Let's save. Um, shit, I think... It was a really good one. Up right. <laughs> like that. There's a great just right there. Preventing you from uh, just cheesing this. But we go up. All right, right. Okay, this I, I remember seeing as we were walking around. There's a stairwell over here that I saw earlier. Yep, we take this down and then this leads over. God damn it, though. I don't. Mm -hmm. Fuck. Okay. This is the actual way we need to go, but I know we missed treasure chests. So, does Seraph go treasure chest hunting, or do I keep... Do I continue following the plot? Oh, fuck it. Hopefully, hopefully it's not that important. Where am I? Wait, Keith is over here, right? Yep, that's where Keith is. Oh, it's the other one I need to get to. All right, so maybe maybe it's not so bad. Maybe we'll wander around and we'll get that treasure chest down here. Could we? Could we? Could we? Could we? That would be nice. All right, that's what we want. We need to get on that land. Yeah, there we go. Hell yeah! <laughs> that's not the treasure chest I saw, but... No, uh... Ah, 
Eyes are clearing as if it had... I don't remember this. Oh shit, I do not remember that. Looks like it does the same thing though. I do not remember that item. I must have gotten it, because I think this is the way we're supposed to go. Oh, Keith, I just saw you, bro. At all, it's me, Keith. Ah, okay, the Belfry is not far from here. The sacrificial ritual is about to begin. At the sound of the fifth bell, the young girl Maria will be executed. Oh shit, okay, we gotta hurry. Uh, at all, you must try to help her. All right, well. Can't hit them with fire anymore? Shit. Maybe I just can't hit these guys with fire. Oh, okay. Well, that sucks. This is where, this is what I think it is though. This is the best hallway to level up in the fucking game. I love farming this shit, although I'm gonna take so much damage fucking here. I remember that. So, remember the very beginning of the game? Where you see the, uh... The, uh... Black Pearl get created? Bingo. And it's amazing how much I remember. Okay. We have reached the goddess's castle. You hear a soft and very beautiful voice. We are the goddesses of beasts. Please come forward. Here's that room where all this shit happened. <laughs> I'm glad you've made it here. We're in dire need of a courageous warrior. Well, I've certainly done my work to get here. The power of your silver pendant has helped you to reach this point. You will need the golden pendant to get to the inner core of the shrine. Right, that's the right one. The wizard has cast many of our people to stone. Yeah, I was there when he fucking did it. One of these unfortunate souls has the pen- One of these unfortunate souls has the pendant. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> right, right, right. The dreaming stone idol is hidden in the belfry. This idol can help return these people to their human form. If you can bring the idol back here, I will show you how to use it. So here's the cool part. Now we can always come back here instead of Bernice's and get uh, health and uh, MP regen. Yeah, unfortunately they say this every fucking time. That I do remember when I was farming for XP. <laughs> I remember that shit. <laughs> Ah, uh, this fucking walkway I remember all too well. All too well. Yeah, from this point forward, everybody just has uh, 256 hit points. They all have max hit points. Oh. Damn it. Nick me. Uh, right, we go up from here. Left. Okay. I knew I had to go right here. This is actually one of the areas I remember a lot because... Ah! Okay. Back to the goddess's castle we go. Shit, 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 shit. Run away! An adult bravely ran away! <laughs> that was fucking something right out of Monty Python! <laughs> But you can see why I remember this hallway so well now. <laughs> oh, shit, man. Wow, that was fucking brutal. Unfortunately, you have to go through the spiel every time you want to regenerate your hit points. I guess so that you, they try to discourage you from just cheesing this, but it's worth it. It is very, very, very fucking worth it. So, yes, here we go. Um... But at this point, we're starting, depending on, let's see, it is 
Theoretically, now that I know how far we are, we could theoretically beat this game tonight. We're sort of closing in on the end here. Now, I don't know if I will actually be able to beat the game tonight. If I get... The, the key is Seraph remembering enough where I don't get lost. Uh, and I don't remember if there are any other completely batshit crazy ways to get lost. I don't... Damn it! Are you kidding me? I just... One more time, with feeling, I will try to get through that hallway without at least getting completely whacked. Ugh. These little bastards. That is a great XP for, uh, hallway for, a uh, walkway for XP, but man, those guys hit like a truck. What I would do to be able to skip this part. So yes, while they're talking, uh, I hope everybody's having a wonderful week so far. <laughs> uh, this is a good opportunity to say if you're, regardless of whether you're watching on YouTube or Twitch, feel free to drop a like, subscribe, follow, depending on the platform that you're viewing this content on. If you're watching me on Twitch, uh, granted, this is not the most captivating moment, but feel free to hit a follow. It's free. I would appreciate it. And it does help the channel grow. <laughs> As you can see, even when we have setbacks, we laugh it off and have a good time. At least he didn't completely, like, blow my ass up this time. Man, those guys really are brutal. Oh, fuck, is there a... there's a boss for this. Fuck. Okay. Let's just see what it's like. I just saved it. Uh... Right. Damn. All right. I... Yeah, okay. I remember this now. Right. Damn. Right. You just gotta be in the right place. Not that. You gotta hit these little bastard things. You know what? Just kill me. Okay. Time to use a healing herb. And, uh, let's see what my status is, too. I may also be underleveled for this. Because we just fought a boss just a level ago. 7,500. All right. Hopefully, we don't need to level up. Hopefully, this is just a case of... You know what? Let's equip the Laria ring. Let's, uh... Oh, right. Let's use the herb first. Since we can't use the herb in there, let's at least have some health going in our favor. And yeah, the idle hawk doesn't even matter because it can't home in on us, so it's just to put the clarity ring. I don't remember if the clarity ring does anything, but we'll do that. Okay, right. Right, right, right. It's coming back to me. It's got to be in the right place. Knock it. Damn it. Hit. Shit, shit, shit. Yeah, I took the wrong path there. So yeah, that's... Alright, I gotta get the pattern right. Once I get the pattern right, you just gotta keep hitting these things. Yeah. So not that. Not that. <laughs> once we get the pattern down, once I get the, the right pattern down, though, we'll be, we'll be okay. Damn. Alright. Yeah, just kill me. Do it. Just do it, do it, do it. <laughs> Alright, do not run right for the right. <laughs> do not run and make a run for the left for the right corner. Uh, <laughs> that was that was bad. Uh, stay there. Yep. Come on, come on. Oh, that's not the right place. Not that. Damn. Still got. Oh shit. Uh, I do remember this bastard. Shit, 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 shit. Oh right. And then. The oh right. 
so depending on when you kill it, it makes everything offset. Oh god, why? Why, why, why? 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 God, why? Oh my god! <laughs> oh shit. So yeah, every time you kill one of these things, it then, um... So if, uh, if Seraph does this right, which is not that, but each time you kill one of the little, uh, little fireball things that follows you around, that's what actually does damage to the guy. I remember this now. This is particularly annoying. Um, okay. Okay. Let's... Let's try to gain at least one level, because... We do, we will gain a shit ton of, uh, levels here. Shit, man. Uh, I remember that boss being such a bastard. And unfortunately, yeah, just farming is just part of this game. They just, you just need to do it, unfortunately. Unless I go back into the uh, water canal and see if I missed something. I may have missed a treasure chest, although... You know what? I feel like I did miss a treasure chest, now that I think about it. It was... Where did we get that one? No, we may have gotten that one. Maybe we got all the treasure chests. Uh, but yeah, we get XP pretty quick, as you guys can see. Uh, it, it adds up pretty fast. Damn it. But I mean, we get like a few hundred at a clip here. Now the, fire, now the fireball does damage to them. Maybe I just wasn't high enough level. Damn it. Now we gotta... Now we gotta deal with the frickin' ball of text. Well, at least we gained a level. Not so bad. actually not so bad. Granted, it's not exactly the most exciting. Alright, so if I do another 80,000, I can get another level and we'll at least... We'll at least take less damage from that fucking thing. <laughs> what a dick! <laughs> yeah, that boss was interesting, yeah. It's... There are some very different bosses in East. Um, that's one of the trademarks of the series. The bosses are... are very different, um... And they, they usually do require you to figure them out. Uh, and some I remember better than others. Yeah, what a dick. Yeah, this is the only issue. Shit, I may even get the life drop for this boss. This might actually be a good boss to get the life drop for. I would have preferred to get the life drop for something I would have preferred the life drop for later, would have much preferred the life drop for later, but if we really struggle with this one, it might be worth doing that. Yeah, I'm not going to spend like a half hour fucking farming, but I mean, that took all of a, just a couple of minutes, but it really wasn't too bad. Uh, one of the nice parts too, the magic of return allows us to go to the goddess's castle. Right. Him. Damn it. Okay, we're just farming here, but I was so stupid. I knew better. I knew better. Mistake I shouldn't have made. Rookie mistake. <laughs> You. We're not going quite as fast as last time. Yeah, last time we gained like 5,000 XP and like nothing.
Firing the fireball certainly helps. <laughs> You. We'll make this, we'll just go back and forth on this real quick. We'll make quick work of these guys. And uh And then we'll go back and we'll try that boss again. Um I guess I'll have to try to see if I can make it across fucking uh Nah, I'll just go back to Lance Village and we'll just buy another herb bucket. It'll be all right. Really not the end of the world. It goes so fast and we regenerate our complete health and MP whenever we go talk to the goddesses. So they're cool that way. <laughs> Damn it, thought I could get away with firing that fireball at it. I could not. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, there's no in between. It's either. Yeah, yeah, it really is. <laughs> It's, uh, it's, it either is kind of easy or it's really hard. Yeah, I'm sure if I did that boss perfectly, I'd have an easier time with it. But I think this way, if we do more damage, I think it takes less hits. Good. All right. So let's... Magic of Return... Prince Village. Let's head up this way. Buy another herb. Actually, I probably don't even need the NP, really. I mean, NP is not that much of a concern, but all things considered. Oh, right, I didn't want to go here. Fuck. Because I'm going to refill at the goddesses. I'm so used to... I'm so used to doing this now, I just kind of did it on autopilot. But we're getting closer. So the game, you max out at 256 HP and MP. So we're getting close to the point where we max those out. Although if I remember correctly, there are still levels that you could gain after your HP bar maxes. Uh, all right, and if we really struggle against this boss, we could buy the life drop and then, you know, away we go from there. Hopefully, I don't need the life drop to get through this. You know what? Let's just talk to these guys real quick. You I don't think you tell me anything new. Right, that's it for that. Let's go back to the goddess's castle. We need to get to the top of the belfry. Or we need to get into the belfry and get the dreaming stone idol, but we also want to save Maria. And she is there. Um, but at least, well, we sort of maxed out. I don't think... All right, let's try... Idol, right, okay, equipment. I don't know why it does that sometimes. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. But we got it! <laughs> we got here without using a freaking herb. Okay. <sighs> All right, back to this shit. Uh, right, actually, let's equip the Clary Ring. I don't know if the Clary, again, I don't even know if the Clary Ring does anything. Uh, I don't know if the Peace of Mind Ring does anything or the Silver Pendant. I feel like the Clary Ring should do something though. But anyway, well, rather than having to save each time, let's just do it. All right, let's try this again and hope they do less damage to us and maybe we can... Whoops, whoops, whoops. Damn. Fucked up there. Hit one of them. Damn it! Took the wrong angle twice. Damn it. It really didn't want to do that. 
I meant to shoot the other one. Oh god, and now they go take really weird angles. <laughs> uh, I thought I got you on that one. Right? Oops. Buddy. Yeah, this one sucks. Damn. Oh, I take way less damage now, though. Look at that. <laughs> I take so much less damage now. Ah, okay, we made it. Oh, boy. <laughs> and that time I had just discharged it. Damn it. Okay. At some point, they're going to stop. Damn. All right. That actually might work. Uh, we got this, though. Look how, it, look how little damage we take now. So, yeah. Um... Leveling up was a good plan, even though it wasted some time. Clearly, leveling up was the right call. Come on. Like, oh, I gotta hit something out that way. So at this point, now this just takes a while. Now this is just tedious. You can see why I remember this, though. As soon as it started, I'm like, what the... Oh, yeah. And at some point, he stops generating them. Yep, and I think we've already hit that point. He's done. It's over. Goodbye. Goodbye. Can you do a level one in peace games? Um, let's, first off, let's save. <laughs> let's save. Uh, can you do a level one in East Games? I don't know what you mean by can you do a level one in East Games? Like, can you just go through solely at level one? Uh, I mean, you'll get enough XP from bosses to to level up a bunch. Um, uh, but I mean, theoretically, everything is possible. Like you said, it's just, it's, if you're underleveled, it could be a lot harder. Because, I mean, two levels ago, each hit from that thing was slicing off, like, a fifth of our hit points. Now, it was, like, all of, like, one, there was like a little sliver each time. So yeah, we still couldn't let it just completely whack us, but it, it was it was almost like trivial difficulty. It was more tedious than difficult. Um, actually, let's, let's, let's go back to the Idol of Falcon. Save. And let's see, let's, let's proceed. A little bit of a hiccup there. I'm not not thrilled with the hiccup. Not sure what's causing that. Yep, we're still in the shrine. Well, we're gonna be in the shrine for the rest of the game, Freakbot. But we're making good progress. We theoretically could beat the game tonight. Um, because the belfry, this belfry thing, kind of starts the last act of East Book 2. Uh, I guess that means hurry. Yeah, I, I probably should hurry instead of chatting with you guys, right? Uh, the first, first bell has rung. The sacrificial ritual has begun. <laughs> Get out of here now, or you will perish like the others. Wish I could tell her the others aren't dead, but whatever. Oh, she means... The other people that they've killed, not the people that got away. Yeah, I could. I love the uh, outside look. So let me make sure everything's equipped. Yep. Okay. Everything's equipped. We're good to go. Up we go. Now I got main character acting. <laughs> yeah, right? Wow, voice acting. Oh, Deep Fry, you have not heard voice acting <laughs> like the Turbo Graphics is capable of. 
Uh, so yeah, there are a couple of issues with the, some of the voice acting in this game. But to be honest, for a 1990 game, this was one of the first games ever to have voice acting. So to even have voices at all, yeah, wait till I play Last of Light. The voice acting in that game is truly putrid. But some of the voice acting in this game is actually not too bad. But yeah, uh, that Maria, that Maria voice clip, that was, uh, that was a little rough. <laughs> oh, Last Alert. Uh, Last Alert is a very memeable game. <laughs> the second bell is rung. <laughs> but good to see you, Freakbot. How are you doing? I mean, obviously, I know there's some stuff going on, but how are you holding up? Can't get that treasure chest. Ah, uh, welcome back. Man, that was fast. Holy shit. I do love how this look, how the whole background looks. Third bell is front. I don't hear yet. Fortunately, there's nothing to really fight on our way up the Belfry. So this part goes pretty quick. <laughs> and finally, the fourth bell rings its death toll. If I ring it once more, the girl Maria will die. <laughs> Let me explain the meaning of this ancient ritual. The ancestral priests of this land lived over 700 years ago, but their descendants still reside in East today. The five bells are the ceremonial warning. Before I shatter their souls and drain the last of their life's blood, <laughs> I do love this. Now please, enjoy the sweet sound of the bell's last ring. <laughs> and the last bell rings with no mercy. Uh, could be. Oh, that was, that was Michael Bell playing Dark Fact, huh? That is actually kind of cool. Dallies disappears with an eerie laugh. I mean, whoever voice acted Dallies, I feel like did a pretty decent job. And yeah, uh, uh, I mentioned this earlier before you showed up, but for the most part in, uh, yep, Drew Pickles himself. Um, for the most part, I would say uh, in East 2, we know, because we've heard of Darm, obviously Darm Tower. Uh, one of the books of East mentioned Darm is the source of all the evil, I think. Um, but we really don't, other than the very end of book one, we haven't even seen Darm. Um, we pretty much just interact with Dallies the whole time. But now, now the barrier is gone. But now we've got the, uh, the Dreaming Stone Idol, which is what we need. Yeah, they actually did get a few professional voice actors for this. <laughs> which is, which was not the case for Last Alert. <laughs> that was definitely, not the case for last alert. <laughs> oh, man. Now we work our way back down. The Belfry, I think, is the highest point in the, Dal in the Solomon Shrine. But that's okay. We certainly enjoy the voice acting. Maybe not for the reason they intended, but boy, do we enjoy it. Maria's body is still.
But now we go and we go back to the goddess's castle and we talk to the goddesses. It's so annoying when it bounces off. Hey, look at that, you bastards. Can't get near the goddesses, huh? Sucks to be you, bastards. Fucktards. You hear a very soft and beautiful voice. <laughs> yeah, she did. Yeah, I know that. She did. <laughs> we are the goddesses of peace. Please come forward. And this room again from the very beginning intro. At all, you've returned the dreaming stone idol. But wait, one of its eyes is missing. Now this makes a little more sense in a se sense. You must obtain the blue orb and insert it into the idol's eye. This will awaken the idol from its dream and the curse of the people will be lifted. In other words, everybody that's turned to stone will be, uh, ter um, you know, transferred back. If you're able to find the blue orb, return here and I will help you. All right, so we got two choices for a blue orb. We do have two choices for a blue orb and now I remember. So we either got Keith or... to talk to Keith though. Hopefully I don't have to talk to Keith. The blue orb? Uh oh, I had it right here in my- good, okay. I was like, there are two possibilities and I'm like, but Tarf came to Ramia Village. I'm like, that's why Tarf comes to Ramia Village. I had it right here- oh god damn it. Are you serious? I guess I have a hole in my pocket. Fuck. Alright, so more running around. I know I had it when I arrived in the village. I might have dropped it when I was talking with Decca. Uh, all right. Well, you know what? Let's talk to you. Child asked for you now outside. Yeah, yeah. All right. I got to find this blue orb. Decca, 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 Decca. Uh, do you have any other new... I don't know who you are or where you came from, but thank you very much. You made me feel alive again. I want to live to see another day. All right. We're making a difference here in the villagers' lives. Uh... This is Maria's mother. <laughs> They'll kill my poor Maria. Okay, the dialogue doesn't change though. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad Adol doesn't tell her immediately. He lost the blue orb? I remember watching a strange man in a black cape bend over and pick something up off the ground. Then the man went into the shrine. He must have been in a demon because the guards let him in without any question. All right, so probably Dally's picked up the fucking thing. There's one thing that's been bothering me. I feel that the air is warming. Could it be that we're getting... Ah, uh, yeah. Is it possible? Could it be we're getting closer to the ground? No, that would be impossible. Gunstin, Sakas, village population. Yeah, we already talked to you. Now that I remember that, though, let's talk to a couple of these people. Nope, you talk to... You do the normal text here. The clouds look higher than usual. Could it be the east is coming down? No, that can't be possible. Yeah, we've 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 started to reach the end game. East is literally starting to descend. Um Alright, fuck. It's in the shrine somewhere. We know the it's in the shrine somewhere. Ah, okay, right. The meeting's fi okay, that's why they tell us the meeting's finished. The blue orb's now in whatever room that fucking meeting was taking place. It seems that the wizard brought something in that prolonged the meeting. Yeah, the blue orb. Okay. Where... Where was that meeting room? Okay. It wasn't straightforward. Straightforward is where the goddess statues are. Because that was... That's where the goddess statues are. We had the boss room. And once we get the golden pendant, that will teleport us into the core, into the east core. Where the fuck is that meeting room? Uh, I think it was over the right side somewhere, right? Think? Yeah. Where the, or maybe it was in mid east. It was that meeting that uh, we could over, we could listen in on the outside, but we couldn't actually get in. 
All right, so it wasn't a locked door. It was a door lock. Okay. We were missing a door. It's just a door I couldn't get into. But we no, no, it's, no, that door is very, very fucking important. We need to find that door. <laughs> now we need to find the door that Seraph couldn't find earlier. Uh, well, and actually, now I'm kind of glad we, well, although if we could have found the door earlier, no, you know what? No, okay, that's right. That leads us over here. Yeah, man. All right, maybe it's in here. Somewhere. Oh, God, we're lost again. Fortunately, the rest of the shrine is not nearly as bad as these, like, introductory areas are. We need to find that meeting room. We need to find that meeting room. I think it's in that mess of doors. If we can find that, we'll be in good shape. Maybe it's this way. Nope. Nope, nope. All right, maybe over this way. Maybe. <laughs> Time hit came in. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> uh, I feel like we did all this already. Uh, well, we're in Solomon East. I, I think we went too far east. Because the meeting room isn't isn't as far east as Solomon East, I don't think. So I think I went too far. I want to say the meeting room's in mid east. So this is part of the problem. Seraph is in the wrong wrong zone. But let's just check it anyway, just just to be thorough. Whoops! It's not get hit with that guy. I am. I could swear that meeting room is in mid east, but it's possible that meeting room is in Solomon mid. But it was early. It was very, very early. So that's that's what helps. So we shouldn't have. Um, so I'm. I think I'm too far. I'm too far right. So I got to work my way back a little bit. Since we already did damage to you. Which means we could spare us this bullshit. Unless it's in that area, but I think I looked there already. Pretty sure we just did look in this area. Yeah, right. And it worked right. This is just an empty room. Yep. Good. Okay. Cool. Remembering that correctly. Back west we go. Nope. We need to go down and then up. Because that, that area doesn't lead anywhere. I don't think that area leads anywhere. This was a gate. We needed the password for this. I don't think anything important was over here, but let's look anyway. Anyway. God damn it. Right, but now we're in Solomon Mideast. I think this... I think our meeting room is somewhere in Mideast. These... Pretty sure the door we're looking for is on this particular map somewhere. That you can't go anywhere, right? Good. But yeah, it was not, it wasn't, because we, we encountered that, that meeting room pretty early on in, uh, in Solomon Shrine. So I feel comfortable concluding that it is going to be around this area somewhere. Back up we go. Out we go. That all that all just links all together. Nothing else in there. It's just designed to get you lost, which it did its job. It did its job nicely. 
But we don't actually need to do anything else over there. If there was anything else we needed to do, it's over now. We fucked this guy already. Right, okay, we need to head back. Okay, so we go back, and then we work our way, uh, so we need to go back east. I think we need to go back east, and then... Right, we go back east, then we need to go back up the stairs, and then we take the bridge back over. Okay, we go back over this way. Because we can't access any of that stuff down there, except unless we go more east. We've already explored that. Our meeting room is not in there, I don't believe. I want to say we even encountered that meeting room before we opened any of those two gates that led to the east and west. So it really should be pretty early. Um, and we're in Solomon Mid here. do not remember this meeting room being hard to find. I think I'm just going in the wrong way. Catastrophe up. Damn it. This is the teleport room. Yeah, this is teleport room. But maybe I need to go a different way in here. Maybe the meeting room is in this part somewhere and I keep just dodging it. Here, maybe. Nope. 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 Hmm. Literally nothing down here. Okay. We go, did go up there. Let's head down. Oh, if only Seraph could remember where that meeting room is. All right, that's just one big circle. Okay. Now, I went in that room. Did I go in that one? I don't remember if I went in this one. Yes. I literally went in this one. I keep going in that one. So let's go in the other one. Maybe it's the other one that I haven't gone into. Uh, no. I'm gonna go down this way. Shit. Maybe I go down? Oh, that's the very entrance. Urgh. That's like Ramia Village. Was the meeting room in Midwest? Shit. Maybe the meeting room was in Midwest. Maybe I'm just totally misremembering where that meeting room was. I mean, it's been a couple of days and I did get super lost wandering around. I feel like I got comfortable with this map, but now... No, I don't... See, here's this. I feel like we encountered that meeting room before getting through even that one. And this... We didn't get through that immediately either. Yeah, this leads us to the water canal. So... Shit. Ah. Uh, oh, Seraph, Seraph, Seraph. Why can't I remember where that meeting room is? Fuck. I feel like I'm in the wrong area though. I don't I don't I don't think that everything's in the west, especially since we looked so thoroughly west last time because we were looking for the uh Ow. Really? Uh because we were looking for the room with the um with the cup in it, and we couldn't find it, but we opened every other door. That tells me... It tells me this is a dead end, but you know what? Let's do it anyway. Yeah, that's shit. Yay, being lost! <laughs> not, not knowing where to go. I mean... To some extent, this is also why some games did add waypoints. But at the same time, I actually do like that this game 
does not have waypoints uh, and doesn't hold your hand for, you know, for shit. Yeah, this is all areas we went through repeatedly last time. It really does make you explore it and know it. Yeah, this, is, this is not what we wanted. This leads just to the back area of this. There's nothing to do back here. It's literally a dead end. We've done this so many times. Oh, no, it's not a dead end, but... Right, that leads... Okay, that actually leads up to the cup. Right. Right, we did that. We inadvertently did that correctly last time, but let's head back this way. All right, we're back. We're back to the Midwest. Damn. This is, like, really bizarre. I am almost positive, though, the meeting room is somewhere early on in the shrine that we could not get to without the pass or the password. I swear. We found that meeting room super early and we were able to eavesdrop on the outside of it. I kind of thought it was this room at first, but maybe I'm, I, I could be confusing it for this room though, for all I know. Maybe I am, maybe it is over in Solomon East. And, uh, and I gave up on it too soon. Let's head over this way. Unfortunately, it's not like they really, oh wait. Uh, no, I need to go this way and then over. Take us over this way. Let's go back to Solomon East. I thought the only thing over here was the water canal, but, you know, maybe there's something more useful over here. Maybe that fucking meeting room's over in Solomon East. Now we're in Solomon Mideast at the moment, right? Because this just takes us through this. Now we're in Solomon East. Vengeful. <laughs> While I wander around aimlessly, hoping, hoping fervently to find this fucking meeting room. All right, let's start. We're able to go this way. This, this is now the dead end. Let's try going in here. Maybe the meeting room's over here somewhere. Let's just work our way over. Hmm. So while Seraph roams around, have, how's everybody else's week going so far? <laughs> May as well chat to pass the time while I'm wandering aimlessly, trying to find this stupid ass meeting room. I know I've gone this way. I know I did this. But at this point, I obviously missed something somewhere, so we've got to be super thorough. God, this is brutal. You know what? I already gave you the pass. Yeah, I know. I know, you already gave me the pass. <laughs> We're doing better than Adol was doing. <laughs> Poor Adol can't, can't catch a break here. Well, that leads up, so... Better sign. And yeah, that just takes us here. Yeah, it's just it's just one big loop. It just spare it just saves you the time to have to walk all the way around. Ugh. Get on spring break, so uh so you don't Yeah, no spring break for you, buddy. <laughs> Fuck man. Where am I going? So that leads all the way around. That does okay. So that door connects to that door. We now know that, for certain, that door leads down there. 
We've gone through that door a bunch of times. What the fuck am I missing? What in the nine hells? Jeez, man. All right, let's... Okay, let's go up this way. I don't feel like I've gone this way in a while, but let's do it anyway. This, even though I know this leads to the water canal, eventually, uh, although we have a couple of ways up here. Yeah, this, this leads to the water canal. But let's see, maybe there's a different way to go. Yep, water canal. But we'll go down. Confirm, just just to be really thorough. Back up we go. I mean, I could go looking around for any other treasure chests I may have missed, but at this point, I feel like I've got all the treasure chests in the water now. I feel like if I just wander around, I'd be granted, I'm wasting time now looking for this fucking meeting room. That shouldn't be this hard. This, this meeting room really should not be this hard to find. Um, I'm kind of surprised that I'm, I'm struggling this much to find this meeting room. I don't remember this meeting room being so hard to find. Uh, I really, really don't. God damn, man. Chest, yep, yeah, we're just... We're just recycling old ground. I'm obviously, I'm going the same, we're doing, we're, we're doing the same thing we did last stream, damn it. All right, we, all right, let's refocus the meeting room. It's in that meeting room where all the demons were meeting. I couldn't get in that door because the fucking demons were in there. It's a door that looks like the master key, but it is not a master key door. Now we'll open and the blue orbs in it. Oh my god. This is brutal. What door am I missing, man? <laughs> now this is down. Okay. I feel like this is not the way I want to go, but look anyway. I think this is just a circle. Nope, there's an empty room there. Uh. And of course, it could be so many different places. They don't tell you really where it is. You just get that clue from, ah, uh, the meeting's over. And then it's like, all right, now that you've been in Solomon East, West, Mid, Main, One, Two, the Water Canal. See if you could fucking remember where that one meeting room was. <laughs> and if you can remember where that was, congratulations, you know where to go. I'm like, are you fucking kidding me right now? <laughs> yeah, it's okay, we did a circle there. Okay. <laughs> Seriously, what the fuck, man? <laughs> what the actual fuck? Yeah, if, if anybody has access to, to a game FAQ and you can at least tell me where the meeting room at least is. That at this point, yeah, I, I think I would take that. Let's, in the meantime, let's do the magic of return. Let's go to the Ramia Village. Let's just start from the very beginning. I feel like it's in Solomon Mid, but we've looked everywhere. Like, good grief. Uh, no, I did not find the blue orb. I still can't, I cannot find that meeting room to save my life. Form. We know, we know that. But yeah, I don't, I just, I just don't remember. 
I just don't remember where the meeting room is. I feel like it's in Solomon Mid. I, I want to say it's like super close to the entrance. I just, I feel like I've looked here. Well, now I've looked really everywhere. So it's time to look here again and see, see what my, what we may have missed. Um, yeah, really, really struggling to find this meeting room. Because you originally find the blue orb in, in Burnland after the poison, the toxic gas. That door is what leads to the teleport room. But so does this. It all, it all just ties together. It all just ties together. <laughs> something down here. Nope. And down there. Maybe a room back here. That's the end of that. Uh, I mean, I don't know. need to know exactly where it is, but like, at least a hint at this point, I think, I think would benefit me. Anybody, anybody's access to an FAQ. <laughs> while I meander, while I wander, to play the uh, Camelot song. If I could do a, a good little Roy Khan impressionation. Although at this point I've been talking for a while, so my voice is all sore. <laughs> but, uh, silently we wander. <laughs> I don't think anybody wants to say <laughs> Oh, man. Plus, that one's awkward not to do in full voice anyway. But that's kind of what I'm hearing in my head. Good old Camelot Wander. Um, yeah, whatever. This leads us to Solomon Midwest. We've gone there a whole bunch of times. We've looked in the Midwest. Midwest is what takes us to the water canal initially. So anything else that I may have missed going around here? Really don't think so. Right, this just goes in the circle. And if you go down the stairs and go up that ramp, that takes us to Solomon Mid-East. Fucking hell. This is the only part that, like, I, is just very frustrating. <laughs> yeah, it would benefit from a map. Um, I mean, I think that was part of the difficulty. Like, they, I feel like that was part of the intended difficulty was um, figuring out where to go. But at the same time, um, it's just, it's really, really fucking hard, man. Especially when you're just like, you need this one item from this place you were at this one time. And I, I haven't seen that room now for days. <laughs> for literal fucking days. Uh, and I just, I just don't remember. I just don't remember where I saw it now. And of course, I may have gotten completely thrown off by thinking it was early. Maybe it wasn't. Maybe it was past one of the gates. Go downstairs. Else, right, we had to go through the password. So we go through here. Go down. That's the water canal. That's the water canal and the runaway hideout. We know that. Don't need to do that again. Wait. Okay, but that was this was a different. This is a different door. I don't think I've been in here. So maybe that's a good sign. I don't remember that. Oh, well, but there's nothing else to do here. Shit. Ah, oh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. That would have been nice. Ah, oh, my eyes are starting to get sore now, too. Oh, <laughs> so brutal. You 
know, I don't remember being able to do that. That's an interesting way to get to Solomon West. That's a new way to get to Solomon West. I don't think we did this before. Granted, we usually go the other way to get to Solomon West, but who knows? Maybe this is... Maybe that's good. Unfamiliar is good. We like unfamiliar. But now we're, we're just in the same place. It's just a big circle now. And they're all the same doors that we were in before. Oh. Maybe I should have played this once be in the 30 years since I played it so I'd remember where that door was. Maybe I shouldn't have done that on stream. I didn't... I do remember having to wander around a lot, although I don't remember wandering around this bad. I think what's happened here is I keep making the same mistake over and over again, and it's obviously completely fouling us up. Weird as it is, I like I still am having fun with this game. Yeah, now's the rotor tree not oh fuck it. Let's be at least charge up on our magic since we're here. Yeah, part of me is almost tempted. Wow, I think I've been... How long have I been looking for this fucking meeting room? I feel like I've been looking for this meeting room a while. May as well save it, because we, we're, we're not in any danger. Now we've got full, uh... Full health. But yeah, fortunately you to find the blue idol. Like, we were on a roll, man. We were on a roll. Uh, I think if we'd kept with that pace, if we didn't hit this hiccup, we could have beaten the game tonight. Um, I mean, theoretically, we could still beat the game tonight. We're, we're getting fairly close, but yeah, I need to find that stupid blue orb in that meeting room. And for the life of me, I don't know why I'm having such a hard time. I don't know why I'm having such a hard time finding it. I really don't. <laughs> I don't feel like... I really don't feel like this should be that tricky to find. Um, I feel like I'm probably making it more difficult on myself than it needs to be. Yeah, we've we've gone up there, right? Yeah, yeah we've, we've done we've done this whole we've done this whole shebang. It's it's not here. It's it's, just, it's not here. It's got to be. Ah, Kara. Hey, how are you, buddy? Welcome, 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 Hustle. Hey, Nikki, you've uh, you've come at an interesting time while uh, while Seraph wanders uh, in circles, trying desperately to find where I'm going. So you know what? This is a good time to uh, let's 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 reel it in. <laughs> it was coming interesting times. Yeah, right. <laughs> let's uh, let's switch to. In chatting real quick. Ah, excellent. Why, thank you, Nikki. I do appreciate it. Uh, so, yeah, let's... Uh, well, that's funny. It's still it's still playing the song here. Uh, <laughs> oh, wow, it's still... Oh, it is still playing. Uh, let's, let's, make, let's just make sure I'm not dying. Okay, good. Okay. Let's... Uh, let's just dial that music down for a little bit so at least you guys don't have to hear it as loud. We'll do that a little bit in the background here. Uh, Kerajitsu, I do appreciate it. <laughs> you know, welcome, Raiders. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're playing Eastbook 2, and uh, I, I've been playing that. I usually play RPGs, so this is pretty on brand for me. And now we're really, really... So, I didn't play any game. <laughs> Yeah, it looks like my bot is uh, is broken. Maybe my bot committed seppuku watching me play Eastbook 2. That is certainly possible. <laughs> no game. The ultimate game. No, Kara, you were playing the game, and now we've all lost the game. Uh, <laughs> so, yeah, this is... Uh, this is definitely interesting. Uh, so, yeah, we're, we're playing Eastbook 2. We're actually getting... We were getting, we were making really good progress. Uh, it's like Reboot, the game of life. Yes. Oh my goodness. My goodness. My eyes are killing me. Um, so yeah, we're, we're playing that and we have, we've done a lot of things. Let's see. Let's go over while I go and wander through. 
Uh, yeah, she's asleep. She's, uh, she's wreaked enough havoc today. <laughs> she scared away one of the neighborhood cats. It made the mistake of, uh, wandering to the front door. And Cleo made it very, very clear that this was her house and that it should, uh, vamoose at the, uh, very, <laughs> at the earliest possible time. That poor cat, yeah, that car cat ran. <laughs> so, uh... Yeah, no, we, I like our stray cats. They keep the riffraff under control. I don't, so Florida has a real big iguana problem, but um, I really haven't seen too much of, actually, let's let's turn that up a little bit, but nothing too crazy here. That's probably a good volume. Um, considering we're just going in loops here, we may as well not jam it up too loud. Um, but yeah, you know what? Let's, let's do magic of return. Let's just, let's go to Ramia Village here. Let's just, Restart, and we'll we'll do this again. Oh my goodness gracious! We'll we'll heal. Um, but East, the land of East is now actually starting to come down. We've we've. Uh... Yep, yep. You're just telling me all that shit. Uh, but here's the key. Here's the key piece of information. The meeting is finally finished. It seems that the wizard brought something in that prolonged the meeting. Oh, it was actually the guard that uh, told us what we wanted to what we wanted to hear. Um, but so yeah, this meeting is over. Yeah, I like that font. <laughs> um, so we know this meeting. Uh, yeah, you mean Cleo is a snake and rodent cat only, right? <laughs> oh my God. So yeah. Um, so Tarf had the blue idol, uh, the blue orb. We actually need the blue orb to complete the dreaming stone idol in order to have everybody wake up from their curse of sleeping stone. We know this because we talked to the goddesses and they've told us this. And so in the time since that revelation, we know, I know I've seen this meeting room because we walked to the outside of it and all the demons are like, oh yeah, there's a big meeting in that room. And for the life of me, I do not remember where this meeting room is. And so I've been wandering all over this fucking shrine looking for this one room that I saw last stream once. And as soon as we find it, we can then teleport to the goddess's castle and we could start the last act of the game. We're going to be in really good shape once we find this stupid blue orb. So, uh, yeah, that's, that's what we're trying to find. Uh, that's what, that's what Seraphs is, is, is trying to find. So yeah, we're, we're struggling a little bit with that, but at least we, we got our full health back. So, yeah, let's just, let's just start from the beginning. I feel like it was to the east. I'm almost positive it was out this way. Let's just, I must have missed it at some point. Nope, we want to go this way and up and then over to the right. On the other hand, I'm starting to get. <laughs> Why, thank you, bot. Now you, now you kick in. Uh... <laughs> On the plus side, we're getting, we're getting the hang of this Solomon Shrine deal. Uh, we know where most everything is, except for this one meeting room. For the life of me, I cannot figure this out. Uh, so now we're back in Solomon East. Let's take a look. But how are you doing, Kara? Uh, how? How's everybody doing? Greetings, everybody. We're going to have a lot of time to chat because all I'm going to be doing is wandering around like a completely fucking lost, totally lost <laughs> fucking idiot. Oh, my goodness. Answer my question, sir. What question? Did I, did I, did I miss your question? I like that font, ORB. Uh, so how close, oh, how close do you, I did miss the question. Totally missed it, didn't even see it. Uh, I am closing in on affiliate, actually. Um, I think I only have 10 more to go. So we're getting there. Um, in New York till Monday night, gotcha. Yeah, we're getting there. We are closing in. Uh, what did I, what was I just doing? That I, I was trying to concentrate on where I was going and make sure I didn't go a place that I went before. So, okay, we went here. Let's go down. I think this just does a circle. I think this just does a circle. Let's kill that guy. Yeah, this just does a circle. Yep. We've now gone in a circle. That's a dead end. Yep. 
And if we go up here, if we go all the way to the top, there are the two doors, one on the left and one on the right. They connect. There's no meeting room, but we'll look anyway. Uh, tell the folks I said hi. Ten more followers. Yeah, got to pass out. But uh, you know, thank you. I, I appreciate that, Kara. Have a good one, man. I will talk to you approximately later. Hopefully we'll uh, hopefully we'll find this fucking meeting room. Um, if I if I even knew what zone the meeting room was even in, that would actually really help narrow it down. The problem is because I don't know what zone it's in. We just look everywhere. <laughs> we just look everywhere. Oh, yes, finally. Oh my fucking god, finally! Oh my god damn Luya! <laughs> oh my god, okay. Now I'll boost the volume a little bit. <laughs> I cannot believe we must have walked by that so many times! I'm gonna we end up rewatching this on a YouTube fucking um, on YouTube, and I want I need to do what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna count how many times I walked by this door, thinking I've walked by it, walked in it, because I know I walked past this fucking thing so many times. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That is the sound of madness. I, mean, I don't want to know what craziness sounds like. That's what it sounds like. Holy shit. I cannot fucking believe that fucking took so long. No, <laughs> oh, yeah, no, we're not breaking any speed writing records. Definitely, definitely not. You know what? I'm gonna go over and kill one of these motherfuckers just to do it. Ugh. Take that for getting me lost so long. There you go. Take that, shithead. Oh my god. So you hear a very soft. I didn't want to run through that. Give me one second, everybody. I will be. Oh, why are my, why are my, oh, okay, Stream Deck is deciding to flake out today. All right, fine. I'll do it manually. We'll just pause it. I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get some water. I definitely need that. Now we're back on track. Although it is curious to see why my stream deck is not registering my... There we go. My scenes, but that's okay. Yeah, no, not breaking any stream, any, any speed running records. Not at all. Oh my God. All right. We are the goddesses of peace. Please come forward. All right, now we can complete this stupid orb. The blue orb is inserted into the dreaming stone idol's eye. An eerie glow is emitted from the eye. To remove the curse of the afflicted people, you must bring the idol to the top of the belfry and hold it up to the skies. The final battle is near. 
I've told the descendants of the six priests to come to the core of this shrine. Which is why East is going down. <laughs> this is what we call a slow run. Yeah, this is what we call a slow burn. <laughs> they are now on their way. We will need all your bravery and might. Please, come to the core as soon as you are able. That being the case, except for being lost twice. I got lost twice. Uh, so it's unfortunate that I did get lost twice, but uh, outside of getting lost twice, I actually feel like I'm doing pretty good considering I haven't played this game in literally 30 years. Um, eh, I think not too shabby. I do want to get to 85,000 here real quick. Let me just do that. Uh, plus that's going to hopefully get my voice a little bit farther. Yeah, that's what should be. That's what should happen. Eat a dick, stupid monster demon wizard thing. Except when it deflects it. It's not cool when it deflects it. There we go. Cool. I knew that would be quick. Up to the belfry we go. It's actually funny how I... Uh, I, like this part, well, I, just, I, I commented on that once we actually got this far. It's amazing how less convoluted Solomon Maine Maria's body's gone. Oh, wait. Right, we gotta do this first. But now look, look outside. You can even see the skies look different. Now we're not floating in the clouds. Now the clouds are very high up in the sky. So yeah, East is, uh, East is lowering. But there are a couple of descendants that were on the ground. And so that's why the whole continent came back down. But yeah, I thought that was a nice touch that the uh, actual sky in this belfry section looks different. I do remember that from playing uh, back in the day. It's like, oh, that's so cool. But it is a nice touch. La, la. Right. Already got the treasure chest. That's where the Dreaming Stone Idol even came from. Yes, Rob. Oh my God, that was almost bad. That was almost water everywhere. But yes, you're right. If I weren't running around for so long, she'd still be there. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Back on the surface. Back up we go here. I'm wondering if I should buy the life drop now or if I should wait. Right, I have to actually use it. As you lift the dreaming statue to the sky, its eyes begin to glow. Cool. All right now. Yeah, fuck it. Magic of return. Runaway hideout. <laughs> Let's just head back there right now. Back to the water canal. And look at that. Everybody's fine again. Are we close? We actually are pretty close. Um, so I might just keep going. I think if we, uh, if I play for an hour, I think we'd like be done, done, like credits and everything. Um... So I feel like I should just keep, part of me wants to just keep going because if I stop here, now I, I, I'll have to debate that. Give me, give me, like, we'll, we'll make a determination in a second here. Uh, Cause yeah, that's, that's gonna be a good question here. Uh, when we were locked in the belfry, a dove flew in. It had a pendant and a letter tied around its leg. The letter was from a guy named Dr. Flair and was addressed to you, Adol. It seems that he found the mysterious pendant in the divine area. He said in his letter? God, come on, text, that he wanted to give this to you. 
Ah, uh, and that's where we get the golden pendant. Although Dr. Flair could have just given it to me earlier, bro. <laughs> uh, if you travel further down the water canal, you'll reach the core of East. Yep. This is where the source of evil emanates. Yep. <laughs> I was locked up in the Belfry. I saw the mountains of the under of the underworld outside. I wonder if East may be coming down from the skies. Yes, it is. Where's Lilia? By the time I... What? Right. By the time I woke, Lilia was already gone. Where in the world could she be? Now, part of me is like... Bitch, I teleported! <laughs> was her first instinct when... <laughs> like, what the fuck, man? You just booked it out of here. Oh, I guess that's not completely crazy, but... Yeah. What are you saying? All right, the demon named Keith told me that... There are others who've been turned into stone. Those people might have regained their senses by now. Okay. Yeah, that's right. Okay. But the water canal is now empty, so I think we can go over there. Alright, so yeah. Uh gimme give, give me a word to pour myself another root beer. <laughs> yeah, right? So yeah, this is um alright, so So Chad, I guess this is a good a good question here. Does Seraph attempt to finish the game now? Or do I save the final, this entire final act for a different stream? Um, and that I'm not, so that I'm not so, so sure. Because I don't, number one, I don't remember how difficult this shit is. Um, and it's probably not going to be a 20 minute affair. Um, I'm thinking we probably, no, it's not totally long. It's not like, we definitely don't have like two or three hours. Damn, if we didn't do all that stupid running around, I would totally be on board with just finishing this. But... I have to make a decision here. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think? Just finish it up, even if it takes another hour, or or different stream. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of what I'm thinking. It's 10:50. It is a tough call. So it's funny. It's funny you mentioned that. The final boss. I actually, much like Dark Fact, I actually remember Darm pretty well. But Dally's, on the other hand, I do not. <laughs> I've I've only fought and defeated Dally's once. All right, so let's save it for next stream. This will be good because I still want to walk. So because we still need to find. Remember that one dude off on his own that we did find. That was uh, Sada. He has. I remember he has an awesome fucking sword. So we still have some wandering around in the water canal to do to find him. All right, so yeah, let's do that. Let's save. We've done We've done our job. We've done all the really bad shit now. <laughs> we can close out of that. We are in good shape. Um, uh, let's see. Um, I wonder. I just want to get a quick sound test here. All right, that's not too bad. All right. Um, so yeah. Good stream. Yeah, good, great stream. We actually, so we ended up overachieving because we found the cup so fast, but then <laughs> all the luck I used up finding, all the luck I used up finding the cup that, uh, that turned us from a monster into human, we then wasted trying to find the fucking blue orb. I just, I just couldn't remember where they, where the, uh, where that meeting room is. If I had known, if I'd been able to remember that it was in Solomon East, we could have saved so much of the looking around that we did in the rest of the entire shrine. I could have just gone straight to Solomon, to the Solomon East area, and we would have saved a fraction of the time. I probably wasted a good 40 minutes looking for that stupid orb. Um, but regardless, still, still did good. I mean, you got the, the full experience, got the full genuine <laughs> playing it like it's the first time experience here. Um, but yeah, there are parts I remember and there are parts that I don't, but I think at this stage, there are only two bosses left. I am pretty sure it's only Dally's and then Darm. And then we've got, uh, the end, the ending sequence, uh, and all that. So we'll see what we do with that. Maybe what I'll do next stream is we'll do that and then we'll start East three. Uh, that might be, that might be a good way to do it. And so, uh, that'll be my plan for that. My goodness, my eyes are burning. <laughs> Let's see who's on and who we might want to raid out to. 
Uh, Kai is playing Final Fantasy. We got Aussie Boy playing Phasmophobia. So it's probably going to be some Phasmophobia because I do not want to spoil myself on uh, on Final Fantasy. Once I play that or Kai starts playing something else, we'll start raiding him again. But uh, you know what? I'll do a shout out for him anyway. Uh, so we're going to do the TurboGrafx version of East 3 first, um, I think. And then, I mean, actually, you know what? I could do a poll. I could either do a Twitter poll or a Discord poll. Uh, and see what you guys would prefer. I, I might just leave it up to up to you guys. I have Oath of Filgana, and I have played Oath of Filgana up until the very end boss. I wasn't able to actually beat the end boss of that game, but I was playing on mouse and keyboard at the time. So now that I've got a real controller, I think I would have better luck for various reasons. I'll, I'll get into that if I play. So I definitely want to play both at some point. Um, yeah, right? I'm here for what I want to play. So what I'm thinking is, I'll just play the TurboGrafx version of East 3, uh, mostly because I think it's easier. <laughs> uh, and then what we'll do is we'll start going our way through, and we might come, we might circle back and play Oath of Filgana later. That way we just play both of them. And depending on how it goes, I might try playing East 1 and 2 Chronicles on a circle back. It's just... I'm not a fan of looking, I'm not looking forward to the level cap uh, that Deep Fry was talking about. Just trying to beat Darm Tower in all of East 1, only level 1, sounds fucking terrible. <laughs> so I think we were level 30 when we beat East 1, and so, um, so yeah. But yeah, well, well, there's still some to be determined. The only thing that might change the calculus on that is uh, when Falcom redid East 3 as... Oath of Filgana. Oath of Filgana is generally considered... Yeah, yeah, level 10. It's horrible. It's, it's I don't know why they decided to do a level cap for that game. That game does not need a level cap. Let us let us level up to get around some of that shit. But yeah, I don't I don't that that decision boggles my mind. Uh but when they did Oath of Filgana, Oath of Filgana is generally considered the more canon version. So uh they're very similar games, but Unlike East 1 and 2 Chronicles for Steam and East Book 1 and 2 for the Turbo Graphics that we're playing, it's not a virtually one-on-one -on -one conversion. So they're very they're very different games. Um, both of Fulgana actually is kind of superior. So yeah, depending on the day you talk to me, it's like, eh, you know, maybe I should play that. Maybe I shouldn't, you know. Maybe what I'll do is I'll do Oath of Fulgana first, and then we'll do a, a, a completely um, uh, nostalgia East three run at some point later. And that might be the way that might be the way I go about it. We'll we'll see. Uh, but for now, let's set up our let's set up our raid and we'll raid uh we'll raid Aussie because uh she is also new and she's a good time. Uh <laughs> she's definitely not uh definitely not politically correct. <laughs> so uh which is also, you know, uh, I have a penchant for some of that kind of chaos. And uh, so I, I appreciate her humor. Uh, yeah. Well, wow. Yeah. Ghost. Yep. Uh, Ghosty's right. We are we are at 39 followers. So I only need 11. We're, we're getting there. Cool beans. That's exciting. It is exciting. Uh, ah, yeah. Uh, yep. OK. Yep. Bunch of people. Uh, I, I, and I think yep, and I, I can guarantee I can thank uh, Ghosty for like three of those directly now that I'm seeing who who followed me uh so yeah she uh they they followed me uh those those followers joined in uh either during serum stream or um or offline but anyway so um yeah sometimes twitch is weird with that uh <laughs> twitch twitch doing twitch things but yeah I, I want to thank everybody for coming out tonight uh I hope everybody's having a great week I had a great time, even when I was lost and we were kind of going like, what the fuck is going on? Um, we were still having a good time. That's always a good, that's always a good sign. So good, good games, good company. Uh, I want to thank you guys for, for contributing to the fun because that definitely helped. And uh, until next time, so my graphics card comes in tomorrow. So I'm not actually sure when my next stream is actually going to be because I have to, um, I have to drain my loop and replace my dying graphics card with the one coming in and all that. So I'm not actually sure when my next stream is going to be, but I'm going to aim for Sunday. And if it ends up being any other time, I will let you guys all know. But uh, in any event, 
I want to thank everybody. That's me now trying to do the whole sign out thing. We're prepping the raid. And until next time, I will see you guys approximately later. Until the next one, ciao.